What's going on everybody, this is Ron from OAS. Today's video is going to be a review on the Newbie Drone 3 inch VIM DJI frame. So enjoy the time lapse and I'll give you my thoughts on the build and how it flies at the end of the video. For a better way to get up out of bed instead of getting on the internet and checking a new hit me get up. First shot, come strut walking. A little bit of humble, a little bit of cautious. Somewhere between like Rocky and Cosby's for the game. Nope, nope, y'all can't copy it. Bad, moonwalking. And this here is our party. My posse's been on Broadway. And we did it all way. Chrome music. I shed my skin and put my bones into everything I record to it. And yet I'm on. Let that stage light go and shine on down. Got that Bob Barker suit game and Plinko in my style. Money. Here we go. So it's a complete build now. Um, I really didn't want to cover the components being built into it or anything like that. I just wanted to jump to the, the final product. So first let's go over critiques. Um, it comes with the TPU antenna mount, which is perfectly fine. It should, uh, and it works pretty well. Only thing it's missing is something that, you know, holds the antenna antennas in place. Um, you know, a TPU that's connected to the print or whatever, that way they don't pop out in a crash. Um, other than that, I mean, it went together very simple. Uh, the camera angle is limited, um, but it, this is not a race frame. This is for cruising and freestyle, three inch, stuff like that. Um, but you know, outside of that, I mean, it was, uh, it was a very good build. Um, one thing I do like is that the stack sits, is designed to sit under the air unit. And then the air unit has specific standoffs that hold it in a very, you know, well positioned place. Um, and if you look here on the side, there's nothing's touching, right? It's not a slam stack. It's not a tall stack. You know, it's just a normal stack and, you know, it went together really well. So, um, the only thing that I would do differently is I would isolate the carbon, um, prior to installing the cap and putting the rest of the frame together only because, you know, I had to do it afterwards and it was a pain in the butt and that was my fault. But other than that, great build went together really well. Enjoy some flight footage. 